Hello, beautiful Libra. Thank you so much for being here today. My name is Marie Rose from Tarot Living Side and PsychicsLive.com.au. Today we're here to bring you your horoscope for August. We're going to start off with an energy, then go into career, relationships and finances. And at the end we'll have a final message for you. Let's see what we have for Libra. What's the energy for August for Libra, please? Energy for August for Libra, please. Spirit has your back. Spirit has your back, Libra. This is changes. Nothing happens by mistake. There's a purpose and a reason for everything. The changes here. You're going to be guided to a particular place or you're going to be guided and, and helped in a particular, particular situation in your life that's bringing you a lot of uncertainty, a lot of pain, a lot of worry. The changes that are coming through in August is spirit is going to have your back in what you do, in what happens. Okay, let's see what else we have for Libra. For career, please. Career in Libra for August. Thank you. Career for Libra in August. Career, place for Libra. That's right, for August. August. What message do we have? Thank you. The Ten of Wands. Some of you are totally confused or you are not liking what you're doing. And if, and if you're unemployed... It's weighing a lot on your shoulders. There's a heavy burden here in your career, Libra. And it's like you're either not doing what you want. You're not getting the results that you want. You're, you've been carrying this burden, this responsibility, both yours and other people's in your life. And here it comes to an end in August. It's the end of that heaviness. It's the end of that burden that was drowning you, that was pushing you down, that was holding you back. It's the end, Libra, to a cycle of heaviness, of burdens. Page of Swords, a new beginning, a new truth, a new vision, a new idea, a new place, a new direction, a new path for you in August. It's like you're coming out of a place where it was so heavy and you're starting in a new location. Five of Pentacles. For some of you, you weren't getting paid. And if you were, you weren't getting paid much or you weren't getting recognised. You were getting left behind. You were getting forgotten. In August, that's going to change here. You make the decision that it needs to change. And I feel here, that's why they've got spirit has your back. For many of you, you've started to doubt of what's going to happen or you've started to doubt in your talents, your gifts, in who you are, in what you stand for. What else have we got for Libra? The Nine of Wands. It's the end of carrying. Notice how you've got the Nine of Wands and the Ten of Wands. You start off opening with the Ten of Wands saying how heavy this career thing is for you, how heavy your career weighs on you. And you finish off with the Nine of Wands. It's like it's coming to an end. There's this new coming through for you, Libra. And in August, don't despair. Don't despair because there's a new idea here that's coming through, a new chance. It's like you get one opportunity to get yourself out of this big mess. For some people, your career is your downfall at the moment, is the area of your life that you are really beside yourself about. Oh, look at that. The Ten of Cups on the bottom of the deck. You're going to find your place of happiness. You're going to go to a new place, a new path that brings you a lot of happiness. All that heaviness, loneliness, abandoned, the burdens, they're all going to get left behind in August, Libra. You turn the page to a new chapter. You turn the page to a new chapter. 
relationships, three of cups, a celebration. In a relationship, there may be a celebration here. This also talks about, for one person here, it could also be you're involved with two other people. So you could be, in August, deciding who do I stay with out of these two people that I'm dating. So for someone here, Libra, you may either be dating another two people or your partner is dating another two people. But it can also mean celebration. So there could be a celebration in your relationship in August. So let's find out what that is. Seven of Cups, choices. Choices here. You make choices in your relationship. You make, you make, um, you decide. It's like you've got to make decisions in that relationship. Or you've got to make decisions about a relationship. What else have we got, please? Maybe someone here is going to be proposed. Someone's going to propose to you, Libra, or you're the one proposing. The Queen of Cups, look at that. For some of you here, you are going to be proposed to in August. Make no mistake. There is definitely a proposal here, an offering of love, sincerity, care, nurturing. And there's going to be a celebration from here. You've got to decide whether you're ready for this. But I do feel that many of you are going to accept and there's going to be a celebration here. For somebody else, which I said before, you gave your love to somebody and now you've got to make choices based on what you gave because there's more than one person in this relationship. But that's only for very few and you know that already. It's not someone that has to watch out for their partner because this is already there. The Page of Cups, look at that. If you were looking for a new love, get ready. The new love is coming your way in August, Libra. There's someone coming here beautifully asking you on a dinner date, on a coffee date, on uh, to go to the movies, to go for a drive, to go for a drink. And I feel that this person is genuine. They're going to offer themselves and truly offer themselves as in they they go they're going to give you the love and the nurturing that you're after and some of you here are going to accept accept i do feel here that there's proposals here for some liberals here you are definitely going to be proposed to in august okay let's see what we have for your finances for libra please Celebration, Libra. Some of you are going to celebrate in August a beautiful, um, a beautiful togetherness. Someone here is coming your way. There's a message or there's someone coming to you with lots of love and good intentions. And I feel that you're waiting for this person. You're waiting for this proposal. You know it's coming. Finances, please. Finances. <laughs> wedding, look at that, look at the wedding, for some of you here, your finances are going to go on preparing a wedding or investing into a wedding, that's where your finances are going, so in August, some of you are getting married and that's where your finances are going to go, this is the minus uh, spirit here and they're just guiding you in uh, any decisions that you want to make connect with the divine as far as your finances are concerned but they're what they're saying also watch what you spend look at that lots of money in august you're going to change a, your hands are going to deal with a lot of money and that might be that you're spending organizing a wedding or you're spending money on something here you're spending you're going to be spending money in August, Libra, I'm sorry to say, but there is going to be some spending here in, in August. Your finances are going to take a hit. And the front door. So I, I feel here that your finances in, in August are going to um, take a big hit through the front door. So you may be ordering things, you may be paying for things, you may be spending things at home, um, you may be, I feel that this is going out. 
You're going out and spending. You're going out and buying. You're going out and doing things with money. But money is going to be a big thing in August for you and you will be spending it. You will be spending it. But I do feel that it's it's spending on good purposes. There's good purpose around here. And look at that. You're going to get some notice in regards to finances soon. There's going to be some news coming around. Sorry, not notices, but a message. You're going to get a message here about something to do with your finances. Um, and that could be a decision you've got to make in regards to your finances. So there is some news here. Maybe you've asked for uh, a loan to buy a new house, a new car, or a loan to do something. And you're, you're going to get information of that in August. Okay, let's go. What else, what else? What's the last message we have for Libra for August, please? Like the video, Libra. Give us a, a comment of or a little heart if you want to send me a little heart. Subscribe if you haven't. We'd love you to be part of our team. Let's see. What else have we got here for Libra, please? Thank you. From one Libra to the other, I say thank you. No need to worry. Your main card is no need to worry. Remember, spirit has your back. That was your first card. And no need to worry. Things are going to work out the way they're meant to. And look at this. These cards keep coming out today. No matter how much I, I think, remain positive. It's like the universe is saying to everyone right now, just stay positive. Whatever you do, don't go into a negative ground. Don't vibrate in negativity. Just be careful about negative words, negative thoughts. Um, there's no need to worry, so remain positive. Those two cards have come out for quite a few uh, readings that I've done today. So check your moon and your ascendant sign. There may be that there as well. Lots of love and light. Thank you so much, Libra. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.